Hi, this is Dr. Tim Kaczynski from Bingham Farms, Michigan, and today I want to demonstrate my extraction, atraumatic extraction technique using the Golden Dent Physics Forcep. This is a wonderful instrument to remove teeth quite efficiently, proficiently, and effectively for our patients. To remove the non-restorable teeth, I'm going to use something called the Golden Dent Physics Forcep, which, are, which is an amazing instrument for me. It's an instrument that is comprised of two components. The beak or the shovel-shaped edge will engage the palatal aspect of the non-restorable tooth one to three millimeters subgingival. The bumper, which has a, uh, you can see here, has a green sheathing, um, um, a soft cover on it, is not the working end of the instrument, rather it provides a fulcrum or a center of rotation for the instrument to atraumatically remove the tooth up and out of the socket. The instrument um, will, the beak will engage the palatal surface of that root, one to three millimeters subgingival. The bumper will be placed as high up the vestibule as possible and without any force, we're not squeezing the handles, without any um, hand pressure, forearm, bicep, or shoulder pressure, we will create tension on that palatal aspect of the root. Creating tension will result in a physiologic response and a, a, a subsequent breakdown of the periodontal ligament, which will allow the tooth to disengage or luxate up and out of the socket following the arc of rotation of the instrument. There is no squeezing of the instrument, and in a matter of a few seconds, you will see the tooth will pop. You may not actually hear a pop, but you will see the tooth luxate up and out of the socket, actually maintain, maintaining that facial plate of bone quite effectively. Remember, you cannot uh, remove the tooth with a lot of hand pressure. It is truly not a, a forcep in that respect. To remove the tooth in total, I will take what we call a tooth delivery instrument, a bird beak uh, forcep, and I will simply rotate the tooth out of the socket in what I refer to as a atraumatic or minimally traumatic extraction technique. Going to the other side, as long as I have a, a firm purchase point to be able to place my beak one to three millimeters subgingival, I can then rotate my wrist towards the corner of the eye and in a matter of a few seconds, that tooth will luxate up and out of the socket. Again, taking my tooth delivery, I can remove the tooth very, very atraumatically in this situation. It's a wonderful technique to remove teeth and maintain facial plate of bone.